The Ministry of Education initiated the Program on Bilingual Education for College Students in 2021 to advance Taiwan's goal of becoming a bilingual nation. The program aims to bolster students' English proficiency and enhance the overall international competitiveness of higher education through English as a Medium of Instruction EMI, courses. The ministry provides 580 million NT dollars per year for the program's first phase, and the second phase is expected to receive 770 million NT dollars, an increase of nearly 200 million NT dollars annually. However, certain Taiwanese institutions, such as National Zhengzhi University and National Taiwan Normal University, already include EMI courses in their curriculum. Each of our university departments must have an EMI course structure with 18 credits. In the master's and doctoral classes, we have incorporated internationalization and developed the program to be taught in English, which we call the GPE course. This program is also utilized for recruiting international students. Attracting international students is crucial for promoting an English medium curriculum because they can initiate the catfish effect enticing more Chinese-speaking students to engage in bilingual courses. Diversity within the English medium curriculum and sufficient teacher support are also vital. The teacher's hourly rate can increase by 1.5 times when they teach EMI courses. Our schools employ over 800 teachers, with a quarter of them being licensed. 60% of the teachers at NCCU completed their degrees in English-speaking countries, indicating significant potential. Taiwan's bilingual program for colleges and universities has just begun, initially focusing on top-tier schools, expanding to more institutions, stimulating professors' willingness to teach, and attracting international students still present numerous challenges. Li Jun, Chen Ruhan, Li Weihua, Jamie Lin Penzon, TVBS World Taiwan.